I'm John McMahon. And I'm Melissa Borden. Police are investigating in Burlington after two murders just steps from downtown. Melissa Cooney is live from the scene on Decatur Street. Melissa, what can you tell us this morning? John and Alyssa, Decatur Street is a, a small street in Burlington's Old North End. Right now, it's pretty quiet here. But police say that just around 9 p.m. Sunday evening, they received calls of gunfire on the street. According to police, when law enforcement arrived on scene, they found two adult men. One was dead and the other was seriously injured and both were shot in the head. The surviving victim was transported to UVM Medical Center where he also died. The victims have not yet been identified. Burlington police also note that around eight on Sunday night, they got calls about gunfire in the vicinity of Vermont Comedy Club on Main Street. Witnesses reported seeing two men flee and police later recovered evidence confirming a gunfire incident. The streets of Burlington, Vermont were filled with violence on that fateful Sunday night. 27-year-old Leif LZZ, a rising star in the Brooklyn rap scene, was found wounded and later died at the UVM Medical Center from a fatal gunshot wound. The incident, believed to be linked to drug-related activity, took place on Decatur Street around 9.13 p.m. In the apartment where Leif LZZ was found, another man, Anthony R. Smith Jr., also lay dead from a gunshot wound. Evidence pointed to a gun being present in the house, leading police to suspect that Leif LZZ had been shot by someone other than Smith Jr. But the tragedy did not end there. On Monday morning, an arson fire broke out and reports of gunfire on another street added to the chaos. While the police investigated the events of that night, fans and friends of Leif LZZ flooded social media with tributes and condolences for the young rapper. As investigations continue into the deaths of two young men, Burlington's mayor highlighted the tragic reality of the city's drug crisis. He called for a renewed focus on addressing this issue, stressing its impact on both public safety and health. Leaf LZZ had gained recognition for his music in recent years and was estimated to have a net worth of half a million dollars at the time of his death. But behind his rising fame and success was a darker world of street life, gang activities, and guns all themes prevalent in his lyrics. Despite collaborations with well-known artists and millions of views on YouTube for his hit song, No Twirl Zone, Leif LZZ's life was cut short at just 27 years old due to senseless violence on the streets of Vermont. Police are still investigating what led to his tragic demise, leaving fans and loved ones mourning the loss of yet another young talent taken too soon by drugs and guns.